Sitting there quite nicely. Who's going to take it? One of the props, maybe. Another big shove. Ball comes through again. In goes a little scrum half. Tanaka to try and stop Gory, but he can't. And that's Gory's first test try. Four caps made his debut last autumn against uh, Australia. work from the scrum half but again he's isolated where's the support for the scrum half very good work McLean finally got up there they're on the charge Treviso needs to go swiftly left and it does McLean again Natoglia and Natoglia's true well Treviso from nothing have got their first try Great pass. And it works okay for Treviso. Gori sees the liberal gap and Eduardo Gori is through. Lovely break by the scrum half. He's got Hamilton in front of him and Gori chips and chases himself and just beyond the scrum half. But again, Eduardo Gori.
certainly if it was a stronger scrum, they would need to bring in uh, bring in a winger. Well, there is the winger coming in on the pop pass out to Eduardo Gori, and Gori slides his way over for his second try for the Azzurri. And even down to 14 men, Italy having no... And where does it go? Nobody knows except uh, uh, Italy. And off and running is uh, Zani. In turn, there goes Eduardo Gori. Luke Hume to try to catch him. Not going to be done. Italy with the try. And the Ospreys now have the chance to go to the right. Oh, it probably should have gone. Valley Davis presents it though. The opportunity now is lost. And Eduardo Gordy has got the length of the field to go. And I'm not sure if anyone's going to catch him. The Ospreys captain, Justin Tipperick, is the closest candidate. And he is just going to escort him into the corner. And Eduardo Gordy from the quickest of turnovers in the opposite corner has really...